when you become a member of this residency program, you get to be linked forever to the history of New York Orthopedic Hospital. Each new member that joins this family really represents what NYOH means to all of the alumni. Going back to the days of Stinchfield and near and beyond, where this place stood for excellence. The goal is that you come out as a well-rounded future leader, researcher, somebody who has every opportunity when you come out of residency to build a huge academic practice, or if you want to just go into private practice, that you're set up in a way that you can be the best doctor and, and leader that you can be. The mission of Columbia Orthopedics Residency Program is to train the next generation of leaders in research, in patient care, and with professionalism. The department finds its strength and roots in its residents, and we pride ourselves on our alumni and the people we're currently training. Our faculty are extremely invested in guidance, whether it's surviving night float to then making bigger decisions about career in terms of fellowships, where to work, what setting to work. We have outstanding research in basic science, clinical, translational research, but really what sets us apart from anywhere else in the country, in my opinion, is the mentorship, the bonds, the camaraderie that people form. The first year of residency as an intern, we're getting in the operating room so often, same as a PGY2, other than when we're on our consult days or our night flow rotation, we're pretty much in the operating room at least a few times a week. There's a lot of emphasis on who to operate on and when. So for every subspecialty, we have a indications conference. The residents will go through the cases for the week, look through the imaging, the history, the medical history, look at the different treatment options and formulate what the best plan should be. And then as you get more senior, a lot of your education is focused on independence in the OR, but also troubleshooting when things go wrong in the OR. By the time you're a senior, uh, you become much more autonomous and are able to pretty much do resident level cases autonomously. Shock Trauma is the premier level one trauma training institution in the world. We have an opportunity to rotate there for two months during our third year. Uh, while you're there, you're taking primary call. You're managing uh, high acuity floor patients and you're also in the operating room taking care of those patients. It's an incredible learning experience, ex extremely challenging, but very, very worth it. Choosing Columbia Orthopedics allows you to push knowledge forward in the field. It's a place where we have leaders in each subspecialty, and they're all going to be willing to help you develop things such as research projects. Each of the interns get paired with a mentor right when we begin our residency. So right off the bat, we're getting paired with a, with a faculty member in our sort of um, desired subspecialty of interest. The different exposure I've had um, with different faculty and different specialties, I think that that's a unique experience that we get here. This is a hospital that kind of gives you a community feel, but at the same time you're getting a world-class education. All the terrific mentors and opportunities that we have while we're here to engage in research and develop collaborative projects across different campuses and different institutions, really expanding our network and kind of becoming the best surgeons and, and researchers that we can be. When I became chair, I set out to basically create what we could call the best six year research program in the country. And the first way to do that was to hire Steve Thermopolis, one of the incredible PhD translational scientist minds in all of orthopedics. The six-year residency track is a program uh, where we are seeking to develop the future clinician scientist. And there's a couple of things that, that we change. The first key change is that the research year occurs before the intern year. The idea is that you can spend that first year setting up your research program. Uh, if it's a clinical project, for example, you may uh, set up your prospective clinical trial uh, during that year and then spend the subsequent years recruiting your patients. Then you start to get the results of your research for those next three years. So by the time you're applying for fellowship, you have a lot to show. I really liked that uh, Dr. Steve Thermopolis, who runs Carroll Labs, um, was really excited about mentoring residents to become clinician scientists, which is something that I'm interested in doing. Columbia is unique in that they really pay attention to what you want to do 
and set up a structure for you to succeed in achieving your personal goals. The department's mission to train the next generation of orthopedic leaders permeates into everything we do in how we think about crafting the residency program, in who we recruit to be faculty for this residency program, how we design our resident rotations, how we implement our educational platforms, how we provide feedback for our residents so that they can understand that they are attaining the goals necessary as they traverse through the five years of their residency here at Columbia Orthopedics.